Cenaga yarik, yar kananin wujud tergagi ngan kau. We're in uh, Image Island, which is uh, part of the Jalawat Atoll. This population on this island and a couple of near ones is about 60 to 80 people. This island here uh, served as a regional headquarters for the Japanese during World War II. And so there's a lot of remnants, including this one we're standing in here. There is no uh, power grid out here. There's no phone service and all that. Uh, they have solar panels on their homes and uh, they can run some dim lights at night. There are no stores, so they will have to get over to Jabor. And even in Jabor, there's just little family stores that have a very small amount of stuff. You know, the basics, rice and spam and corned beef and different things like that. And they do rely on the natural plants and the ocean, of course. Ministry leaders Rastin and Jewel Lanway have traveled from another atoll, Majuro Atoll, where they grew up and their family lives, to come here and serve. So they've chosen to come out here into a place that is unknown to most of the world. They have joyful spirit and they just give willingly as they serve and lead the people here. <laughs> Pocket <laughs> It just became kind of an easy way for the people on this island mainly to communicate. People were starting to get on and they were asking for prayer, they were asking for a devotional, and so Rastin and Jewel actually developed that into a community event. And people get on their little radios and they sit in their homes and talk to each other and they share their, their needs one to another. <laughs> The gospel is meant to go out into all the earth. The scripture says how beautiful are the feet of those who bring good news. And that's what they're doing here in Image. And people are uh, growing in their faith. They're coming to the Lord. They're understanding his great love in a much deeper way. If you enjoyed this video, like it and share it. We are always posting content, so don't forget to subscribe. Thank you for helping us share change.